The final losses are still not known from our historic February winter storm. But one thing we do know is you are running out of time if you need to get help due to animals you lost. The Livestock Indemnity Program helps commercial livestock producers recover losses from Oklahoma storms. It does. It's a two-part process for LIP. The first part is the notice of loss. You don't need full documentation for this first part, but Amy Hagerman says a key 30-day deadline for the loss notice is coming up fast. Full details are on the FSA website in a LIP fact sheet. You actually have through most of the rest of the year to get the application in after you get the notice of loss in. And that's where all that documentation becomes really important. Bank loan documents, vaccination records, or even photos with timestamps are helpful, but that can be tough in the moment. It's so hard to think about the documentation um, as, as you go along. You know, there's no such thing as a good emergency. You lose one, you got to pick yourself up and you do your best to save the next one. Ryan Milam, a rancher in Lincoln County, is grateful for the help. We're very appreciative. We're very thankful for the help that we are getting. But humbly and reluctantly admits more is needed. We need more help all around. We need more backing. Ryan, we're thinking of you and all those who've suffered losses. If anyone lost an animal due to sickness after the storm, you might also be able to get help. Field meteorologist Michael Armstrong, KOCO 5 News. <laughs>